good morning, no, afternoon, it's afternoon for me, it might be morning for you, could be evening, could be midnight. Anyway, hello, um, my name is Emily, this is my first vlog, so I thought my best way to introduce myself and my horses would be to do a meet the horses and a yard tour of my yard. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> eating hay so she won't put her head up but this is summer some wait come here this is summer she is a 15 hand thoroughbred cross connemara mare she's 16 at the moment i've had her for over a year we mostly compete in show jumping but occasionally I do a bit of eventing and other things with her. But yeah, it's mostly show jumping. That's what you'll mostly see us doing. But um, yeah, she's having a good old itch. Um, yeah, she's my main horse. I do share her with my mum, so the two of us ride her. But I am the one who mostly rides her. But um, yeah, she is my pride of joy. She's currently coming back from an injury. We had our first canter back today, and um, yeah, we're hopefully taking her to Arena Hire next week to do a do our first jumps because we've only got fields and the ground's too hard to jump her on at the moment. I'll probably do that. Next some. Anyway, uh, next horse. Next to Summer, we have Tin, who's a lot more friendly, and more happily talk to us. Tim is our livery, he is not mine. Um, I do ride him occasionally for them when they're like away or they can't ride him. He is, I'm not sure what breed he is, but he's about 12, three. He's older, he's about 18. Yeah, but I only ride him when they can't, so you'll probably just see him in the background of vlogs, but here's, yeah, here's our yard. We've got a fence there, that's a hose pipe. There's Timmy's stable and all his things are here. And then we have Summer and her stable. And Summer's boots, we've got her magnetic boots, which she normally wears during the day when she's not being ridden. And then her boots, which I've just used. I always air her boots out on the bars after I've used them just to get any sweat or anything. And here we have Mac's stable, which hasn't been mucked out yet, but will be in a minute. Um, Mac is the other pony, but he's currently out in the field because he needs extra grass time because he um we struggle to get keep weight on him so he only spends half the day in and he spends the rest you'll meet him later on um yeah over here we've got a uh, rug rack with all the rugs we're currently using so we've got summer's fly rug and a lightweight we've also got summer's fly mask and head collar so hoof picking bucket there poo scooping stuff here and Max fly hood and head collar. This is our tack room. It's rather small, this, yeah. We've got a very small tack room, but it's only three for three horses, so it doesn't really matter. We'll start over here, we've got, um, these are my saddle pads. These are the clean ones ready to use. So we've got my Lemieux Bennett and Blue, and then a green one, which is uh, Felix Bueller, I think it's pronounced. And then we've got a plain black one. And then down here we've got uh, ones we use for shows. We've also got another show one which is at home to be washed. And we've got Max Girth, which is not used. Then we've got uh, stable rugs on both of these. I've got a towel and mum's overalls. But yeah, we've got um, stable rugs and sweat rugs and yeah, under rugs on here. And then fleeces on that one. And then we've got over here we've got our kettle and tack cleaning stuff. And then we've got drawers, which are, these. both of these drawers are spare tack and first aid supplies. And then the bottom one down there is where we keep our boots. So we've got, you know, Summer's 
uh, fetlock boots, support boots, hivers, boots, and then our whips in the corner here, which I'm not going to touch because they've got a spider friend. Here we've got our fly, things like fly spray, uh, mane and tail conditioner, and my, oh, drop the sponge, uh, stain remover. I'm going to take that sponge up a sec because I don't want a spider on it. Uh, yeah. Then we have my riding things down here. So my boots and my hivers and my riding hat are in here. This is our to wash pile. Currently only has one saddle pad. And underneath we've got spare boots and things. Mostly this is stuff we need to sell, which haven't which we haven't yet. And we've got grooming brushes uh, for these are just general grooming brushes as well as uh, hoof oil in here and then we've got um, fairy solution which I use for summer's feet and then we've got in here our grooming brushes that we don't use and then down here we have my grooming kit for summer and underneath in this bag is my cross country thing so my body protector, number bib and medical armband Moving up from here, we have our bridle rack. Um, here we have two broken head collars, one of which can be fixed and will be fixed soon, and the other is just there because I don't have the heart to throw it away. And then we've got lunge line and side reins, which I don't personally use for lunging because I don't like them. And we've got a spare head collar, uh, Max showing head collar, which we might use maybe one day again. And then two spare bits that we don't use. Here we have Summer's Hackamore Bridle, which mum uses for hacking. I don't use it because I don't like how she goes in it with me. And then behind that is her martingale. And also two bits that we use for dressage. Well, I can be bothered to change her bit. Here we have Summer's Normal Bridle. And behind that is her breastplate, which we use for um, cross country mostly, and shows. And we use the martingale for everything else. Up here we have Max Bridle, which because he's retired doesn't get used anymore. And Summer's two uh, flight modes. We've got her Ulan Equestrian one and a Premier Equine one back there. Here we have Tim's Bridle, which has a fantastic brow band. I'm very jealous of that one. Uh, down here we have a trunk which is full of stuff we don't use essentially. There are some spurs which I need to drag out which are down there because I'm going to start trying spurs with Summer. But yeah we've got my stuff which is my coat and my bag there. Then we have our liveries things, all of that. That is all our liveries things so they're not ours. And we have two saddles up here which we don't use. We have one with a twisted tree and Max saddle which isn't used because he's retired. Then we have pictures here, here of um, past ponies, also here on the notice board. Apart from Summer and I at our first competition, that is not a past pony. Um, here we have Summer's saddle, which is covered up by her exercise sheet, which we only use in the winter, but yeah, there's her saddle. Then we have the bin underneath that. Mum's hat is there. Then we have spare riding hats and old riding hats and just riding hats that aren't used. Here we have the very important and muchly used because I have a grey horse um, washing up uh, horse cleaning supplies, such as you know my smart grooming deep purple shampoo, which I use a lot. Then we have Mum's riding boots just there, and that is our tack room because it's absolutely tiny. And yeah, there's really not much to it. We've also got, you know, this is for bridal. And then we have my very first ponies nameplate. So yeah, that's actually the whole yard. Oh wait, no. Come around here. Completely forgot that this bit this exists. This is our feed room essentially. So here we have our yeah. Here's our su supplement shelf. That's all our feeds there. Very beautifully decorated by me. But um, yeah, we've got all our supplements up here, Tre very important treats back there. Um, here's all of our feeds, we've got sugar beets soaking for later, feed buckets, 
spare feed buckets, and then all of our feeds. We've got mucking out tools there. That is the corner of doom, as we like to refer it uh, refer to it as. It's mostly just tailored wraps and broken buckets and things we don't really necessarily need. Then we've got electric fence supplies there. That is our pallet which we hang our hay nets on to soak them with. Currently Tim's hay nets there. Here we have the partitions from our trailer, the back partitions. We've got the front ones in but just the back ones because Summer needs to travel with just the front ones because she needs to spread her legs. Um, and yeah our trailer's just too thin for her. Then we have Livery's wheelbarrow, rubbish, our two wheelbarrows. We've got his are a very extensive amount of bedding, which is three bales, but um, that's just um, replacement bedding that we're using for now until the straw is cut. Here we have our hay, and then we've got our liveries, hay, and feed and tools. And oh yeah, we've got Max rocks all the way up on there along his because on the other side of that wall is Max stable. And up there we have our winter rugs on top of the tack room. Uh, that's all for the actual stables. So I think we'll go out to the fields now, which are just around the corner there. And we'll go meet the pony that we have not met yet. So we've just come around that corner there. So around the corner is where the stables are. This is the driveway and here are our fields. Um, this is Summer and Mac's field. Mac is coming our way now. Here he comes. Um, yeah, and then we've got Tim's paddock. Oh! <laughs> yeah, we've got Max. Uh, that's, no, that's, that's Mac. That is Tim's paddock there. It's incredibly low grass because one bite of too much grass and Tim has laminitis. And then we've got spare fields at the moment. Hello. So this is Mac. We've had him since I was six years old and I'm now 18. Um, yeah, he was the pony that started it all really. Um, I learned to canter and jump on him. He's now retired, living his best life. He's a 11-1 Dartmoor pony, loving his life, making it incredibly difficult for us. And yeah, our trailer is there. And the fields that we ride in are through that gate and I can't be bothered to go show you them, so I'll just insert some clips of me riding up there now. Um, so yeah, I think that's all I have really to show you. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. I'm on my gap year now, so I'm gonna be spending this year just chilling with my horse. And I thought, why not give myself something to do and vlog it? So that's what I'm gonna be doing. So yeah, subscribe if you want to see my adventures with Summer and Mac and I'm sure Tim will be in it partly. Um, yeah, and also like, comment, and if you want to know when I'm posting videos, please do, uh, press the bell, because that's something you have to do. So, Sam, do you want to say goodbye? Do you want to say goodbye? No. Okay. I just gave her a section of her, she's eating. Bye!